Are you looking for an outdoor dining or perhaps outdoor kitchen with a view? A great spot to exercise, explore, sightsee and more? Hi, Shanna for Sajuna Online talking today about our online map. I'm at a must-do spot in Thevenard and in under 10 minutes and travelling at a leisurely five kilometres from Sajuna Visitor Information Centre you could be here enjoying all that this spot has to offer. It's a spot with the lot. So I'm looking straight across the bay at the moment from a place called Pinky Point in Thevenard uh, at the township of Denial Bay and I'm at the top of the point here now. Um, <clears throat> downhill here out of sight is a free to use barbecue under permanent shade complete with table and seating and a bin in the, the immediate area. <clears throat> There's a separate uh, earth track that takes your vehicle right up to that shelter so there's no need to lug all your bits down from the car parking area if you're carting, cooking and eating bits. And next we have, I wonder if you can see it but there's a little trail running along there, running along the, the edge there um, which is called the Encounter Trail. And it's a 3.6 kilometre sealed walking and cycling track that provides frequent park bench seating to rest and take in the view and uh, history and information boards to read as you wind your way along Murat Bay foreshore uh, from the Sajuna Sailing Club up to here at Pinky Point. Uh, and just out of sight, down this hill here, Along that trail, right, right on, right on side that trail, is a sturdy staircase um, that leads down to the shoreline. For those wanting to explore a little further, uh, Pinky Point Lookout is the best vantage point via which to gain those images of the Thevenard Wharf and any ship that may be present. Also. Uh, a vision under lights at night time. The telescope at the lookout that you can see there in your shot can be used freestyle and is free of charge. Um, it can also be lined up with markers located around the barrier to look at specific spots from um, a list that's also provided up there as part of the signage. You can see right before us here uh, that the lookout has disabled parking allocated immediate, uh, in the immediate vicinity um, as are park bench seating, history plaques and information boards, some of which you can see there in your shot. For a further photo op, you can't miss the decorative lighthouse which is a mosaic sculpture and it contains the names of souls lost at sea um, on the lower panels. Yet another spot to dine. We're we talking about this green shed just beyond the vehicle there. Um, with even more shelter and table seating, uh, or even a great spot to roll out your yoga mat, <laughs> uh, is the l &E k Interpretive Shelter. This spot comes complete with its own photo opportunity in that the um, in the Eleni K ship anchor. The Eleni K was a ship that broke its back and sank just 90 minutes after leaving here on its way to Port Lincoln to take on more wheat. The sunken ship was refloated and reallocated to its current resting place between Goat Island and St Peter Island in the Noitz Archipelago, which is a group of islands off of Sajuna. The Eleni K shipwreck now provides one of the best shipwreck dives due to uh, the ship sitting upright and the top of the bridge only being about two metres below the surface. Finally, we have ample parking. Uh, it goes down around the corner from your shot there that you can see there uh, still. Um, so ample parking inclusive of larger and longer vehicles and no need to reverse if you're towing. A reminder, however, uh, that camping is not permitted. 
Enjoy this and many more great areas, sightseeing locations, photo opportunities, self-drive tours, things to do and more on our online map. Find it all on sojourneronline.com.au